Welcome back viewers. In this video, we are going to work on update image. The reason why I am making separate video for update image because first we will delete image from the folder and then we will update image to the database. That's why it will be more simple and clear and you will see what's going on and you will understand better. I will go to my directory. In my case, it is in desktop, CD desktop then then my shop and i am already here in my shop if i go to now open with vs code and now i am inside here my product so here you can see we have image fields i will change them and uh, you remember before we have the problem of the image is required so that one i will go to here in product where we have this image required i will just remove this required from here and uh, all required image i don't need from here and just save then i will go to add product you can see here we have this and i will just come here add required this is a html5 tag so you can make required here then simply I will copy these three image fields and I should have copied before but now I will just remove this required everything is good from here and for update product I will I will save and now we have to go to input and in route you know we were here in update product so now first of all we have to import OS and here we have import secrets and also we will import that OS and then come to down here the route of update products and before the session.commit here I will give that if request dot files dot get and we will get the image name equal image one and then we will go and delete that image from the folder this will be os dot unlink and here will be again os dot path dot join and here we will join path of the current app I guess we don't have imported that current app. We have to import that current app also from here and from Flask. We can import current app and then come back to write this current app. You can see dot root path and here we will write that static and then image plus product dot image underscore one then after and we will just go and copy this one from add product to the photo and come down here and just I will do again product dot image one equal to this one so there will be some problem if the image it cannot find that image so what we can do we will give them the try and exception if it will try to delete and if it can find this if not cannot find then it will go to exception and accept for the accept we will simply add this image first it will try to delete this image if it can find this image the here in database there is only part of the image the image itself is inside this Im image static image folder first we will try to delete this image from the folder and then we will upload new image into the database and also inside this 
folder. So we have three images. I will go and copy this and paste it three times. One, two, three. Now we have these three images and just change the name to two and here will be also two and here will be also two and all here we can make them two and this one will be three 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 and here also will be three so now we are done from here so let's try here and do the debug and start debug so now our app is running i will just go to here localhost and then slash admin and admin i have to login i am login here first i will change this apple image and uh, if i go to desktop in my shop inside my shop shop and then we will see in statics image we have these images here and I'm going to delete this image and replace with one new image so let's see I'll go here and I have this image and you can see we don't have this image here but just I will do and hit the update and you can see this image comes here we have successfully updated our image and if I go here this image was not deleted this is now the problem why this image was not deleted it should be deleted so let's find out why we could not delete this image so for that I have to go to in the route in the product then the route and uh, here in image we don't have this slash I have to give this slash everywhere and then yeah now save it and our program is already running we don't need to run it again I will update the same same image because this image is different from the other image we can find out things very easily I don't have too much image here now for the demo purpose I will just do for this image so I, I will come here and hit the update now it's updated you can see here the both images are same and now the new image is gone so I will delete this image and again replace this image with that image so you can see this image will be gone from there now I will come here again for the first image I will replace this image to this image and again and you can see this image comes here and now we have this image here and the newly updated image is gone now we will test for the other record if we are going to this is the name of something glassy and apple I will just make some change of this apple I will make this pro one and discount before about zero I will make it two percent and I will change I will upload this so I will change with this image and then third one so third one will be here with this if we go here we can see we have these three images and two will be replaced now I will come here and hit the update it's updated and here we have this image and if I go there and you can see and this place are empty and those these two images were replaced and uh, here you can see the other things are also updated like MacBook Pro 1 and 2% 
of discount and I don't want this one to be like this and I will just replace as before then this should be MacBook Pro and I will hit update again you see here this image is updated and the things are working very fine this is all for this video thank you very much see you in next video we will delete the records from database take care bye bye